It's no surprise that air conditioning and refrigeration systems work harder in hot weather. Ooh, but some of the most serious problems can occur during cooler weather. Why would you even need air conditioning in cold weather? Actually, it's fairly common. Many buildings are tightly insulated. They can be full of things that generate heat, like computers and other equipment. Temperature and humidity need to be tightly controlled for some manufacturing processes. And refrigeration units, such as supermarket freezers, run year-round. So air conditioning and refrigeration systems often need to work in a low ambient environment. But that can be a problem because when the condenser is surrounded by cold air, it works a little too well. The head pressure drops and the system becomes less efficient. That can lead to evaporator freeze-ups. In the worst cases, liquid refrigerant can get pulled into the compressor where it can cause a hydraulic lockup, a condition known as slugging, and that can lead to compressor burnout. The usual solution is to install a head pressure control. That helps keep the head pressure up and the refrigerant from getting cold. But not all head pressure controls work the same way. Most head pressure controls cycle the fan on and off to control the head pressure in low ambient conditions. When the fan cycles, however, the system pressure can swing wildly. This stresses the system and often results in inconsistent cooling, rattling ducts, clanking pipes, it can even lead to leaks. Fan cycling also puts a lot of unnecessary wear and tear on the condenser fan motor and compressor. ICM Controls has come up with a better answer, a field-proven line of low ambient condenser fan speed controls that have stood the test of time. If the system pressure gets too low or the condenser temperature gets too cold, the ICM control lowers the fan speed rather than just turning the fan off completely. As the fan slows down, it pushes less air through the condenser so it sheds less heat energy. It's like being able to change the volume of the condenser coil. Instead of the all or nothing approach that other head pressure controls take, ICM's low ambient fan speed controls make sure the condenser fan always runs at the correct speed for maximum efficiency. Head pressure is maintained without inconsistent cooling. Clanking pipes, or the extra wear and tear that can shorten the lifespan of your equipment. Here's another way to see the difference an ICM low ambient fan speed control makes. This graph shows how head pressure changes over time. With a typical head pressure control, the condenser fan starts out in the off state. As the compressor runs, the head pressure rises until it reaches the control's set point. Then the condenser fan comes on and the pressure drops until it reaches the control's lower set point and the fan is turned off. This cycle repeats. Now compare that to the ICM low ambient fan speed control. The fan runs continuously at a lower speed, making fine adjustments as necessary to maintain just the right head pressure level. Besides cutting down on overall system wear and tear, ICM low ambient fan speed controls have features that protect the condenser fan. A field programmable hard start function applies full voltage when the fan starts to ensure full rotation and lubrication. Installing an ICM low ambient fan speed control is fast and easy with most systems. The control can monitor system status either through a temperature probe in the condenser or in some models a transducer that tracks system pressure. The temperature probe is easy to install but takes several seconds to react to temperature changes. A pressure transducer is more accurate and responsive but if there's no Schrader valve, you'll need to evacuate the system to install it. Of course, that's not an issue for OEM installations since the system hasn't been charged yet. In addition to low ambient conditions, these ICM controls can also be beneficial in other situations where a cooling system is running below its capacity. This frequently occurs with variable air volume systems when some of the rooms aren't being cooled. You can rely on low ambient fan speed controls from ICM. The field-proven design has been performing in real-world conditions since 1990, and they're quality built in the U.S. ICM Controls has a full line of low ambient fan speed controls to suit every application, from air conditioning and refrigeration systems that use either low-level DC or line-level control voltages to three-phase systems. One of our application engineers will help you select the right unit. Prevent evaporator freeze-ups, liquid slug compressors, low pressure cutouts, unnecessary wear and tear, rattling pipes and ducts, and compressor burnout, not to mention unhappy building occupants or the loss of perishable goods. Ask about the ICM Controls line of reliable, low ambient fan speed controls. Call us toll-free at 1-800-365-5525 
or for your nearest authorized ICM distributor, visit us on the web at www.icmcontrols.com.